When taking classes online, try to treat them as if you're in a physical classroom. Schedule time, sit down, concentrate, and don't forget, you paid for the class, so make sure you get something out of it. Number two, hold yourself accountable. Set goals to be accomplished. Prepare for your big assignments in advance and ask a family member to help you keep yourself accountable. And remember, this is your time to endure your self-learning experience. Tip number three, time management. Schedule major assignments in a calendar and give yourself enough time to do them. Create a weekly or daily schedule for your things, personal and schoolwork. Schedule a specific time to do your assignments and stick to that time. Learn when you learn best and use that time in your favor. And check your progress and make any adjustments needed. Tip number four, create effective study area and stay organized. Make sure this area is not associated with any other activities such as eating, watching TV, or sleeping, then uh, this area will help you to be focused with your studies. Just be sure to make it a routine and that you have all the resources you need before starting to study. Number five, eliminate distractions. Do the things that may rob your attention first so you can focus on your studying. Eliminate any unneeded noises around you that may disrupt you. Set time limits on your apps or turn off your phone completely and ask a family member to not disrupt you or a roommate during your student time. Tip number six, figure out when and how you learn best. For example, if you're a morning person, set aside time in the morning to study. Setting aside time when you study best will help you accomplish your study goal. Also, are you a visual learner? Then print out materials to study. Or if you do learn by listening, then be sure to find time in your schedule to play and replay all the videos. I'm here to tell you about ergonomics, the study of how you work in your workplace and how your body fits in. When you're using your computer, make sure you keep your feet flat on the ground, you keep your eyes level with the screen and make sure your arms are fully extended to the keyboard. Take your time, take deep breaths, and take regular breaks. The rule is work 20 minutes, take a 20 second break, and while you're taking the break, look 20 feet away. That way you'll keep your eyes closed when you need to and bright open when you need to also. I know you're taking the class by yourself, but nothing could be farther than the truth than that. You actually have a whole network around you. It includes people like your instructor, who you should maintain a relationship with, a tutor to help you through the tough times, and when you're writing a paper, make sure you send it to your proofreader. Don't forget your advisor that told you the direction to go and what degree you want to study. And of course, don't forget your family. They might be the most important part of your network. This network together puts together a strong chance of you succeeding. Make sure you use it.